I really don't like that you feel like you can't be yourself. Hi sweeties and welcome back to my YouTube channel, The Sweet Life of Mary Kay. I'm Sweet Mary Kay and I don't like that you feel like you cannot be yourself. You were created with a specific purpose. If you weren't supposed to be the way that you are, then why would the maker of the universe create you like that? I don't like that you feel like you gotta switch up who you are when you get around certain people. You're not too much, you're not extra, you're not over the top, you're not too shy, you're not too quiet, you're not too reserved. You are just the way you need to be. I don't want you to feel like you have to keep up with what so and so is doing on social media or what so and so is doing at church or what so and so is doing at school or what so and so is doing at work. I want you to do you. There is beauty in being yourself. Imagine all of us walking around here the same person. There will be no room for creativity, uniqueness, individuality. Like you are who you are and there's beauty in who you are. You are who you are for a reason and I want you to embrace that. You like the things you like. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You want to do the activities you want to do. There's nothing wrong with that. You are who you are and embrace who you are. You walk into different rooms, be you. Of course, there are ways to carry yourselves in different settings, but I just don't want you to switch up who you are because of people. And you already know that if I'm talking to you about this, best believe I done had to learn this lesson. I remember growing up just throughout my years, being called too much, you ask too many questions, you're too loud, you're too extra, especially when I'm passionate about something. And it's like, who said that is too much? Who said that you're the boss over who I am? I had to learn not to internalize everything people said about me because honestly, some of them weren't even comfortable with being who they are. I'm going to be who I am. I'm not too much. I'm just exactly who God wanted me to be. He obviously needed my personality for my calling and my assignment. He obviously needed my personality for people I encounter and people who follow me on social media and just people who I interact with. There are some things that I just be so discouraged about myself about and that's the very thing that people love. So I want to tell you, the very thing that you feel like you got to switch up for other people, that you feel like you got to dumb down when you walk into certain rooms and when you're around certain people is the very very thing that people need you for the very thing that people love about you God created you fearfully and wonderfully made the Lord knew you before he put you in your mother's womb he already knew who you were gonna be he knew what your accountants was gonna be like he knew what your makeup would be he knew how you would communicate with people there is somebody out there that needs your personality there's somebody that out there that needs your zeal there's somebody out there that needs your quietness there's somebody out there that needs who you are not who you think that people want to see, but who you are. And so I want you to be yourself. I don't want you to feel like who you are is a problem. You're not a problem. I speak to your self-esteem right now. I just pray even right now that you begin to walk into who you are called to be because you are needed on this earth. There is nothing wrong with you. I don't care who lied to you. I don't care who told you that you weren't good enough. I don't care who told you that you were too much. I don't care who told you that you weren't enough. You are. And there's beauty in who you are. And so moving forward, I hope that you begin to embrace who God created you to be. I hope you begin to love yourself. I hope you begin to tell yourself every day that you are beautiful, that you are created beautifully, that you are called for a purpose, that you are chosen, that there is nothing wrong with you, that you are amazing, you are great. I want you to start speaking that over yourself confessing that over yourself remember that death and life is in the power of the tongue so if you ain't got nothing nice to say about yourself don't say nothing at all you know that's the golden rule or one of them you know so many but anyway I hope that this video encouraged you. I hope you liked this video. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. If you have anything you would like to say, comment below. If you feel like somebody can benefit from this video or this channel, please do not be selfish and share the link with them. Connect with me on Instagram at sweet underscore Mary Kay. Subscribe while you're here. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.